casting my homemade version of the uh, Jim Pfeffer banana into this little canal sidearm of the river. Probably I could persuade a perch or small pike to strike here. I've been trying this river now and then for sea trout. Also, they say that salmon are moving up the river, coming from the North Sea and through the river Elbe into this small river here. I've already tried last year, but uh, only thing I caught was an umbrella. <laughs> Maybe you've seen my video of it. <laughs> And this little Jim Pfeffer banana looks like it swims very attractively. Hope the camera would c capture the move. It just twitched a bit. Uh, looks like a, looks like an attractive lure. Okay. Oh god, what the heck is this? I hooked the fish, big fish. What is this? Oh dear. It's an asp, I think. No. It's a trout, sea trout. I hope I'm not gonna lose it. I hope not gonna lose it. It's my first one. First one in my life. I'm shaking. I got it. The first sea trout in my life. First sea trout in my life. I'm shaking, man. I'm so happy. It struck my homemade feta banana. I'm so happy, man. I'm going to take this one home. I'm so happy. My feta banana. Homemade last year. Oh, my wife's gonna give me a hug. Look at this fish, man. The first one in my life. Okay. Hi, folks. This is my first good fish in this little river here. I thought it's a sea trout, but I think it's even a salmon. 70 centimeters. I'm absolutely over the moon. I'm so happy. I'm shaking. I've been wanting for years to catch such a fish. Now I finally made it. And best of it is that it struck my little homemade uh, pfeffer banana lure. I did not expect it as this thing is running so shallow, but it still did. I'm absolutely over the moon with this fish, absolutely. We are going to cook it at home. This is much better than all of those stocker trouts in the pond. But I've been doing hundreds and hundreds of casts to get this fish last year, now this year, now I finally made it. I'm absolutely over the moon with this one. Okay, thanks for watching. <laughs> <laughs>